Hello and welcome to the Fight for Women's Rights Battle Against Patriarchy. I am T. Erica Patterson, your host, and I will be taking you through a variety of women's rights issues all month long. Make sure you like this page, make sure you follow us, and make sure you attend the event, the live event, on January 22nd at 7 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Central, and we will be broadcasting live from Facebook. Your tickets will fund grants for women entrepreneurs. We want to help women who are working for themselves, working hard, creating brands, and adding value to the world. We want to help them move further. So all of your tickets, the sales for the tickets will benefit women who are entrepreneurs. We want to make sure they feel supported. In this very first video, I want to share about me. Why should you um, join the fight for women's rights? Well, the fight for women's rights is the fight for human rights. Do I hate men? Absolutely not. I love men. I support men. And I do believe that men will have an easier time in life if they vow to support women. I believe that men need to be um, nurtured and supported and feel free to be supportive to, to the women of the world. And once we are supportive of women, then men will be freer to be who they are. That's just my thinking. So the fight for women's rights was really organized out of my desire to bring something awesome to the community here in New Orleans. I live in New Orleans, Louisiana. I came across a gym that had a boxing ring. And I said, wow, wouldn't it be cool if, if there was an event here called the Fight for Women's Rights? It just came up quickly. So that inspired me to create this event. And through a lot of different twists and turns, I, it ended up becoming a Facebook Live event. That's not at the gym, but it's still an event that you can enjoy. I have a man by the name of master patriarchy coming to fight me <laughs> and we're going to engage in a physical fight and we're going to um and before that i'm going to showcase my talents um featuring songs original songs dances um creative performances and poetry yes i am i'm, I'm kind of talented and if i'm not at least laugh and clap along with me anyway so who am i where am i from i'm originally from miami florida and I am 42 years old right now. I am a single woman. I have two sons, Cy and Solomon. They're 19 and 21 right now. They are in college in Florida. I am an author. I've published 17 books. I am a YouTuber. If you want to follow my emotional journey on YouTube, on YouTube, I teach um, mental health and personal success. I do deal with and battle with and manage mental health issues myself like many people you know in this society however I'm more vocal about it and I share because I want people to know that they're not alone I also want people to know that just because you have mental health issues doesn't mean you're useless in this world doesn't mean you have to give up doesn't mean something's completely wrong with you I do have these mental health issues that I battle with however I still achieve every goal I ever I've ever had so my desire to fight for women's rights and be an advocate for women's rights stems from my mental health issues. Actually, I feel unsafe in this world. I feel unsafe, unsupported most of the time, and it causes me to isolate myself. And that isolation and that feeling of unsafe, which is causing my mental health issues, is a result of trauma. Because of the trauma that I've been through in my past from people who have also been abused, they were abused and then they turn, in turn abused me. And in collecting all of that negative energy and all of that trauma, it has caused me to feel like I, at times that I don't belong in this world and at times that nobody cares about me. And I take all that in and decided to try to make effort to ensure that no other women, woman feels that way. So how do I get rid of trauma in the world? Like that's my plight. I want to make sure everyone, men and women and children, everyone feels safe, secure, supported and cared for so that they don't have to go out and abuse others who in turn go out and abuse others. And it's just a ripple effect across the world that's hurting everybody. We're all just hurting each other because somebody's been traumatized and hurt. How do we get rid of that trauma? Well, I have a plan, you know, I'm trying to implement it. And I do believe it starts with women's rights. I do believe if we were to recognize that women are equal human beings to men and they should be afforded all of the rights and privileges and abilities and responsibilities that men are afforded, then 
the men would be more relaxed because they don't automatically have to take on leadership roles. They don't automatically have to play a prescribed gender role. They don't have to be something that they're not, which I believe causes a lot of them to feel anger and lash out because they're, they're, we're, we're all trapped in these gender stereotypes and it hurts us. And if we were free to be who we really wanted to be, what brings us joy into this world, I honestly do believe that everyone will be happier, feel safer, and they will treat others with more kindness, which will eliminate abuse, which in turn would eliminate trauma related issues like the ones I have that are affecting my mental health. So I'm, I'm always honest. I'm always open. You can find me on YouTube if you want to look me up. You can Google me and find my professional portfolio to see all of the programs that I've created over the years. As an independent, self-directed women's advocate, I have given away grants that are self that have been self-funded from my, my work as a waitress. I have um, created programs that coach women on confidence and coach them on writing books and influencing others so that they can feel proud of who they are and they can take where they are and earn income from it. I've also been sharing my journey in podcasts as well as in albums and music albums as well, just trying to Show people that you might you might not be perfect, but you can still create your goals and you might not have a perfect mind right now because of the society that we live in, but it doesn't mean that you're not worth anything. So in this world, my gift to the world is my advocacy for women and my advocacy for women is the same advocacy for human rights. I want to create world peace through promoting the advancement of women and mental health. Those are my goals. And I'm glad you tuned in. I'm glad you decided to join me. Continue to um, like and follow this page and, and share this video with your friends so that you guys can get to know me more in advance of the fight for women's rights on January 22nd. If you can't attend the event, attend the event. You can always buy an event t-shirt to show your support. Remember, ticket sales will fund, a portion of the ticket sales will fund the um grants for women entrepreneurs and one grant will be awarded on january 22nd to one amazing entrepreneur so i want you to see where your money is going so i'm excited i'm happy to explore some women's rights do some cool interviews with people who are also advocates for women's rights and if you're an advocate for women's rights and you want to be a part of this program and this rollout between now and january 22nd please contact me my information is on this page and i look forward to hearing from you i look forward to sharing with you and i look forward to uplifting Lifting you, both men, women, and even children, to, as we try to create a world that is more peaceful and inclusive and fair for everyone. All right, guys, I'll talk to you soon.